Okay, welcome back to this Viking Model 10M. Again, an amazing Swedish made machine from 1935. And what we're going to demonstrate now is what most of our buyers and bidders are looking to see, and that is a very heavy grade piece of leather uh, for a sew off. We don't deal with the light, soft uh, type leather like a lot of sellers will present. They'll put lots of layers, and uh, that stuff is just so easy to get through. Uh, it really is a bit misleading. We use genuine leather, and this type of leather you would see uh, in making uh, uh, horse reins. You might see it used in some pieces of the saddle making, uh, and certainly in, in the use of making gun holsters. It is unbelievably thick, as hopefully you can see through the camera. This is the kind of leather that we use, and for that very reason, our confidence in our machines is so high, using anything less would really be an insult. Follow me down to the needle and watch what this Viking 10M does with that 1.5 amp genuine Swedish motor with leather as thick as this. All right, here we go. I have been good on every other video and I decided to finally let loose a little bit and I still am not even close to maximum power for this machine. I didn't do a very good job of sewing straight either, although I could say I was doing like a little alteration there or something on the alignment. But look at the stitch quality. My sewing straight is not so great on that, but I'll tell you one thing, the stitch quality speaks volumes. The spacing, the formation, uh, just the overall stitch integrity is as good as it gets. And again, look at the thickness of what we just went through. Unbelievably thick. If I turn it over, an equally gorgeous lock and stitch to boot. And you know what? As easy as that was, it'll be just as easy when you get it into your own home.